Goodness news covering the flu now for weeks. We've been telling you about the school vaccination clinics here in Rhode Island as the state tries to protect all children against H1N1. But things have been much different in nearby southeastern Massachusetts, where limited doses have been reserved for only those most at risk for the virus, leaving the majority of kids unprotected until now. Eyewitness News reporter Danielle North joins us live with details that are new at 5. Well, Massachusetts certainly has a very different way of distributing the vaccine. The Department of Health there has been doling out what they have to health care providers and not doing mass inoculations like Rhode Island. But after complaints from some families, New Bedford has scheduled its first public school clinic. Massachusetts has not done a good job. After only seeing a sliver of the state's requested supply of the H1N1 vaccine, the director of New Bedford's health department announces its first school vaccination clinic. Concerned families across southeastern Massachusetts have been waiting for weeks. It starts next week at Roosevelt and then moves from there. So the parents should feel uh, secure in the fact that we are going to move this through the city as quickly as possible. The city believes it will have enough vaccine available for more than 800 middle school students. Up until now, the H1N1 vaccine was only available through health care providers for at-risk and pregnant patients. I've asked that the commissioner begin to speedily provide uh, the city of New Bedford, at the very least, and uh, other urban areas, obviously, around the state, with uh, uh, appropriate vaccines. But in the meantime, parents of those children receiving the first round of shots have to sign consent forms, and school and health department officials are working behind the scenes to make sure parents are informed. On November 23rd, we sent out our first uh, letters for the Roosevelt parents, and we followed up using our iAlert system, which is a phone calling system, which is currently up and running. Now, there are three middle schools in New Bedford, and we have learned that the city is planning to do its next clinic at the next middle school starting on December the 8th, and then it's on to the high school level. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom tonight. I'm Danielle North, Eyewitness News.